Hi YouTube, I am doing this video with one baby strapped to me, as you can see here, and another little boy running around. Say cheese. Cheese. Okay, now go play in your sandbox. No. Okay, well anyways. Um, the reason I am making this video is not for another update because I just did a video a couple days ago. Um, but I am having squirrel problems or bird problems. I'm not quite sure what's digging in my garden, but I've taken some measures to try to stop them. And I'm literally pulling out all the stops. If you have any ideas of what I should do and I haven't done them here, let me know. I want to do them. I, I definitely need to get rid of these squirrels. They're eating all of my beans. Um, okay. So the first thing that I've done is I've added all these crazy little tinfoil plates and they're just dangling from strings and they kind of reflect light and they make a little noise as they hit the, the bean trellises and, uh, and hopefully that'll scare them away or keep them at bay. Um, the other thing I've done is I've got chili powder all around on the soil. And I don't know if that's going to do anything, but it kind of smells good. It makes me want chili. And third thing that I've done is I've got some food to distract them. It's kind of easier to get to. Yes, the squirrels can climb this very easily. And they hang upside down on the bird feeder thing there and they eat it. They just like claw at it with their hands and eat it. It's kind of cute. They look like little bats because they're hanging upside down. Um, and of course the birds can get to it very easily. So those are the three things that I've done to my garden bed here after of course re-sowing my beans. Um, so yeah, like I said, if, if you have any suggestions as to other things I can do to try to keep the squirrels at bay or birds, whatever they are, I haven't actually seen them in the bed. I just see the holes and my beans are missing. So something's been eating them. Um, yeah, ideas, either post them in the comments below or send me an email or make a video and add a link from here. And uh, yeah, I look forward to hearing what you guys have to say. Thanks. Bye. Oh yes, I almost forgot. The old chicken wire trick. Of course, I've already put up my trellises and I can't quite lay the chicken wire flat down onto the bed, um, which would probably be the better way to do it. Um, I also don't have very much chicken wire left, as you can see. So I'm just going to kind of put it around, um, you know, a couple of the uh, tomato cages here, and that might kind of deter them. It might kind of annoy them enough to try for something easier, like the seed over in here, which I've already shown. But yeah, um, just so I don't get a billion comments saying don't forget to use chicken wire. There we go. I have some chicken wire. I'm going to get some more. I'll figure something out um, eventually. Oh, here's the cute baby shot. Oh, there we go. 